Alright, in this lesson, we are going to learn on estimation on square and cube root. Uh, basically, the main idea is estimation. Now, using calculator, when I press square root 200, I know my answer is 14.1421, etc. Uh, using calculator again, if I were to press cube root, I know I will get 5.848 something, right? But the question is, if I ask you to calculate without using calculator, how do I estimate the value of um, 200? Now, uh, of course, in primary school, when we learn estimation, we say that, oh, we can either round up or, or round down, right? So, for example, 5.8 if I were to round up then this will become 6 now uh, and of course if I have 14.1 if I were to round up this is uh, this number is less than 5 and I know it's about 14 but in this case if I were to do my presentation in this way uh, straight away I will get it wrong now, the reason is because to get this number, you need to actually use your calculator. So how do I present the working correctly so that I will get my marks? So this is how you should do. Now, when you have square root 200, you know that it is uh, the exact answer is 14.14. Then in this case, you have to consider uh, in order to round to a number that you can uh, either you can get a perfect you can get a, a, a nice a whole number when you square root so in this case this is what I will consider I will have 14.14 right okay, let me use blue so I know that it is either 14 or 15 this is the nearest uh, whole number right but which number is it closer? Now obviously, it's 14 and not 15, right? So, instead of equal, I have to write it is approximate to square root of a whole number that can be square root. So, in this case, what I'll do is I will press 14 square on my calculator and I will get 196. So, then I can write here, this is approximate to square root 196 and then this is not approximate but equal to 14 this is how I do my answer now pause the video now and try cube root of 200 all right let's uh, go through the answer in this case cube root of 200 what I'll do is I know that the answer is 5.8 I know the answer is 5.48 and means this is either a 5 or a 6 uh, I will do a cube to see which number is closer to 200 now let's try if I have 5 cube I press my calculator 5 cube is actually 1 2 5 where 6 cube is actually 2 1 6 so then the question is which number is closer to 200 the answer is 216 and not 125 so in this case i will have to write this is approximately equals to cube root of 216 and is equals to 6 so note if you write this as your presentation you will not get any mark in fact you will get zero and you have to present it is very important to show proper presentation to ensure that you get the mark 